If you look across the world today and you see some of the most innovative knowledge economies, Japan, South Korea, Israel, they have very high rates of higher education and that's because our higher education systems globally are producing the kinds of skills that employers are increasingly looking for. And so if you want to be able to access really valuable work opportunities during your lifetime, you need to acquire in many cases the sorts of skills which you're going to get at a world leading university like Birkbeck, an ability to think critically, be curious around the world, analyze complex problems, synthesize material and present it convincingly and that in many cases is what employers are looking for in, in their workforce. Well all of the above <laughs> really but above all I think it's got to stimulate things that are going to go beyond uh, generating a sort of a, a high earnings profile. A university is about a lot more than you know what you simply earn post-graduation. It's about whether you're able to contribute as a citizen, whether you're able to you know, make a big contribution to your society. Um, so it's something that generates a sort of a sense that you're part of a bigger whole than just you know, someone who's generating a stream of earnings that, just, that we call the, the sort of the graduate premium. Be curious, be flexible, be ready to change. We're not going to have one job uh, our entire working lives. You know, we can expect, you know, if you're a young person graduating from uh, leaving school, you can expect probably to have eight or nine different careers by the time you eventually hang up your boots. Um, so you've got to be ready to be to, to retrain and ready to be flexible. And that's why institutions like Birkbeck. Um, which have flexibility built into their DNA are really right for the changes that we're going to be seeing over coming decades. Part-time, flexible um, education tailored closely to the employment opportunities of the future, absolutely critical. The world needs more Birkbeck because we're entering into a phase where more and more employment is going to be flexible. Graduates are going to be looking at eight or nine jobs over the course of their working lifetimes. And institutions that can help people reskill, retrain at moments that are convenient to them are going to be super competitive in this environment. Well, renewed, renewed growth. I mean, this is one of the most important higher education institutions in the country because it offers something really distinctive, which is that flexible provision, which is going to be essential to how we deliver higher education in decades to come. So we've got to recognize that Birkbeck is distinctive and special, and it's got to have security of funding from government and, and others that enables it to deliver that essential mission.